Luke 17, 1 and 2, the church must stand up for children. And he said to his disciples, Jesus is speaking, of course, Temptations to sin are sure to come, but woe to the one through whom they come. It would be better for him if a millstone were hung around his neck and he were cast into the sea than that he should come that, that, than that he should cause one of these little ones to sin. The church doesn't stand up for children. The church rages against homosexuality, which I, I now admit it's sin. That's fine. It's sin. But they, they rage against it as though it's the worst thing anyone's ever done, and all it is is just sin. It's just sin. Plain and simple, it's just sin. Oh, y'all, please forgive me. That was very rude of me. I apologize. It's just sin. And the church doesn't preach against child mexual abuse. Y'all know what? You can't say certain things on YouTube. And the reason is because so many people in the church are doing it. That is one of the reasons. The Baptist, I guess it's called the Southern Baptist Convention, but it's a major grouping of apparently thousands upon thousands of Baptist churches. They recently released the names of people who had been accused of different kinds of um, S harassment very legitimate. Some of them had been prosecuted. Some of them had multiple accusers. These were very strong claims. And like I said, some had actually been prosecuted. 200 pages. They are just as unrighteous as many of these Catholic priests. I, for some reason, thought that it was 200 people, but when I saw this video, and this lady was a Baptist, she said 200 pages of people names of people so we we got to start speaking up for children we got to start speaking up against abuse of all kinds particular particular particularly s abuse we got to start speaking up against that it is an abomination okay they're trying to say homosexuality is an abomination it's sin but an abomination where you cannot come back from what you do to children, Jesus said it would be better for you if you had a millstone tied around your neck and you was plunged into the ocean. That's how serious that is. Whereas Corinthians chapter 6 talks about people who are gay, they can come to the Lord. It puts them in the same category as thieves and revilers and it's sin. You got you to gotta repent. But it's not like abusing a child. Most gay men or women for that matter... Do not abuse children. Sorry, I was in the lifestyle. They don't. They're not interested. Okay? We have to start standing up for children. Hopefully it's not because the church is, the leadership is too busy abusing children. You just hope and pray that's not the case. For many churches, it is the case. Help my humble channel to grow. Like, subscribe, share, comment. Any combination thereof. God bless.